Hello friends, Kavita here. In this video, I will show you two ways in which you can use your stamps to create project other than the cards. You can check the supplies at Mudra website for the wide varieties of stamp and other craft supplies. I am using a MGF coaster which is painted in chalk paint and I will be using gilding glue for this and I am using this beautiful stamp set I am using the one of the butterflies from this so what I will be doing is I will spread the gilding glue evenly so that it is as good as an ink pad where I can uh, lift the glue on my stamp and stamp it on my coaster so I realized that I will need a little more glue so I am using to spread it again put it on my stamp and then I will stamp it on my coaster give even pressure all over the stamp to get a good impression the first time You can see we have got such a crisp stamping. Now I am using a gold leaf for this gilding process. These are very delicate so we have to be very careful using it. I will just put it over the stamped image, rub it lightly with my fingers and then using a gilding brush I will remove the excess part you can see how beautiful this looks you can use the same process to make a set of coasters gift for your family and friends you can make use it as a fridge magnet anything you can think of now to complete this using the same stamp set i am uh, stamping the sentiment using the archival ink i've kept it very simple here uh, i didn't do any background or anything if you wish you can always go ahead and uh, make the background and uh, to finish it off uh, using the same archival ink i am just uh, uh, putting it a layer across the border so this is done now moving to the second project here also i am using a mdf coaster and painted it using a chalk paint i am using this beautiful sentiment stamp in this project using a embossing ink pad i will be stamping this on the coaster you can see we get such a crisp stamping every time now I will be doing heat embossing on this. I am using a white embossing powder for this process. Now after putting the powder I immediately realized I did not use the anti-static powder. Basically I use only the talcum powder before heat embossing. So now to fix this I am just taking a thin brush and trying to remove any excess powder on the sides. Once that is done, using a heating tool, I am embossing this. I am decorating this coaster using swirl chip zips from Mudra. I am just placing and seeing how I would like to glue them. Once I am happy with this, uh, I will first color the chip zips using a bronze uh, acrylic color. Now I would simply glue this chip zip on the coaster to complete my project. These chip zips add extra interest to any of the project that you use in. There are wide variety available in the website. You can go and check it. So here it is my second project of the day completed. I hope you enjoyed the video. Do check the Mudra website for their products. 
थैंक यू फॉर स्टॉपिंग बाय हैव अ ग्रेट डे